afternoon, Mustangs. I'm Erica Bailey. And I'm Hunter Kimball, and you're watching Mustang Nation News. Don't forget, if you are competing in UIL this year, join the Mustang Academics Group in Schoology. Yes. There will be a UIL calculator and mathematics meeting on Thursday, September 15th in Mrs. Watson's room in 10. Please pick up forms and calendars before then so you can have them signed to turn in at the meeting. If you can't attend, please email Mrs. Watson. Every student competing in UIL must fill out and return a drug form in order to compete. This is the same form used by all sports as well as band and choir. If you need one, you can download and print one or ask your sponsor for a form. Picture day is tomorrow for all freshmen, sophomores, and juniors. If you haven't received your order form, freshmen ask your BIM teacher, sophomores you need to ask your PSCT prep or pathways teacher. Sophomores, if you don't have these classes, ask your English teacher. Juniors, you need to ask your English teacher as well. Make sure to get this taken care of immediately. As a reminder, as part of the new dress code policy, if a student is out of dress code compliance, students will be required to comply immediately and will receive three days of lunch detention on the first offense. Disciplinary action will increase thereafter. If there is time when the student must wait for a change of clothes, etc., the student or the student is late or misses a class, a tardy and or unexcused absence will be given. The varsity football team won last Friday against the Leveland Lobos, 77-76. The Mustang offense battled to outscore Leveland in a race for touchdowns in double overtime. The crowd was overflowing with spirit as they flooded the field after the game to celebrate the victory. Make sure to congratulate our Mustangs and get ready for the Spirit Day, Tacky Tourist, for the game against the Monahans Lobos. That wraps up today's announcements. I'm Erica Bailey. And I'm Hunter Kimball. Have a terrific Tuesday. Stay gold, Mustang.